guys so nini leaks blast andy cohan and wendy williams come on in let's just just lovers welcome back to my youtube channel where you get all the hot topics and trending stories politics and whatever is happening all around the world all right guys i talked about mini leaks before i told you if anything pops up i will bring it to you all right guys so nini leaks blast andy cohan and wendy williams all right so nini leaks just put out a video where she was explaining to her fans that she's leaving the real housewives of atlanta which is the show, the reality show that she's been in for years now. So after she did that, Wendy Williams went on her show and she was explaining to her co-host, as she would call them, that Nini Leaks is leaving and stuff like that. That was okay by Nini. But when Wendy Williams went on the Andy Cohen show and she was running her mouth, Nini was not having any of that she called out andy and she also called out out wendy williams <laughs> so i will read to you what nini leak said so she said last night was the first time i have commented on anything that wendy had said prior to me said nini Wendy went on her show, she talked negatively, a couple days later, she talked negatively again. Then she does the Andy Cohen's show and here she sits speaking negatively of my exit and bringing my family into the equation. Now, that's what you are not gonna do. Wendy, I'm reading this to you in Nini's voice. <laughs> According to Nini, Wendy speaking negatively about her family is where she drew the line considering that she signed up for the reality show but her family did not. So anyone is allowed to talk about her, Nini Leaks, because she signed up for this show. But what she's not going to tolerate from anyone is when you start talking about her family that didn't sign up for the show. So, she's like, guys, keep my family out of your mouth, Wendy and Andy. I'm not tolerating this from anyone. And what is really getting Nini fired up, in my opinion, is because if you've been watching the Wendy Williams show, you would know that Wendy Williams, after her divorce and the whole uh, saga with her ex-husband, um, Kelvin Hunters, yes, his name is Kelvin, okay, not Kevin. Kelvin. Yeah, that's his real name. The name his mama gave him. Kelvin. Alright, so after her uh, divorce from Kelvin Hunter, she, you know, Wendy became a different person that she started talking to people, you know, that she never used to talk to. And one of those people that she really, I, I think they even went out a few times because she has said it on her show. If you watch the Wendy Williams um, show, you will hear her talking about Nini Leaks. She talked about Black China. She talked about visiting the Kardashians and, and just, uh, you know, many people. She talked about Cardi B and people like, you know, um, stars like that. So I think Nini Leaks and Wendy Williams, they are somehow, if they're not friends, they are acquaintance at least. So I think Nini Leaks was not expecting Wendy Williams to go out and say this um, hurtful stuff about her. That's my opinion. I just, I just, you know, somehow if someone that is not close to you talks about you, it doesn't really bother you because in your, in your mind, you're like, I, I don't even know you or I, or I don't even know you like that. You know, we're not that close. But when people that are close to you say hurtful stuff about you or say things that are not true or, you know, they just put out things that you really, you don't really expect them to say because you would not say something like that about them if you were asked. You know, it's kind of hurtful. So I understand where Nini is coming from, why Nini is pissed, because she wasn't expecting Wendy Williams to talk about her and then go further to shade her family. 
that's tacky in my opinion anyway so i think that's why nini is really pissed and she went on her youtube channel where she said people should tune in so they will get the real gist okay so i'll read you the rest of it i said i signed up as a real housewife said nini i signed up to be a part of television my family never signed up to be a part of anything they don't have to be colorful i am the person that have been colorful and you tell me what the other housewives on any franchise is doing with their children that is so entertaining that you actually needed to go so low she added a lot uh, she added a lot into windy calling a possible nini family spin-off boring that's what she was talking about that wendy williams should tell her what other housewives are doing that with their family that is so entertaining that wendy williams will actually say a thing like that about her and her family and she went further to tell andy that andy should stop using her for clickbait or using her as a clickbait and she said <laughs> that andy should remember that's andy Cohen should remember that no one knew him before he knew her so when people started knowing who andy Cohen was was when he knew her nini leaks and she said to windy that instead of windy <laughs> to sit down at home and look for a way to drain her legs she's out there talking trash that she should sit at home and try to drain her legs i know some of you didn't get that part like what is she talking about drain her legs like windy looks okay okay i think windy has a problem called lymphodemia or something something of sort that makes her leg swell so if you really take your time to look at windy's some of her photos you will notice that her legs is giant you know so that's what Nini Leaks was talking about. That she should sit at home, put her legs up somewhere to drain the blood instead of going around and talking trash about her. All right, guys. So leave me a comment below what you think. I think this Nini, she's she's. I just love her. She she always has something to say. She's always ready to fire back. All right. Leave me a comment below. And let me